Lot number 15, Bhavna Kumari J. The great words by John Maxwell, if you help people and give what they want, then you will receive everything which you need in your life. Wonderful morning to all present here. Today I am going to motivate with my speech, Karma is Boomerang. Anyone who is squatch matcher in his life must have seen that whatever we do, good or bad, it always have a tendency to come back in the form of other. The meaning of karma is in the intention. The intention behind the action is what matter. Those who are motivated only by the desire for the fruit of action are miserable, for they are constantly anxious about the result of what they do. Karma is like a wheel which rotates continuously as it goes up, same as it comes down. As well, you can see any persons, families, institution who has been always successful, but after some time they become nothing. It's like hero becomes zero and zero becomes hero. You can never predict about time how changes its turn. So intelligence human should concentrate on his or karma only, as this only go with human after his life. Rest all things that is money, families, relatives extra will be left here. It is very difficult to keep in mind on this non-belonging, but it's true to remember. Always try to do good karma, helps other and try to understand people with empathy. A human who understands person's feeling will be compassionate and kind. If we see in our life, then we'll find this principle of karma is applicable to all. If we do good deeds, good will happen to us and if we do bad deeds, bad will happen to us. If you will dig a pit for someone, then you will yourself fall in that pit. And and if you do good to others, then good will come back to you. If you want to live a happy life, then start giving happiness to others. Because what we give to others will come back to us. That's why it is said, the evil you do remains with you and the good you do come back to you. Let me share a story with you. The story is about three friends and a bag of gold. One day, three friends set out on a journey. When they were passing through the forest, they saw a bag lying on the ground. They picked it up and overjoyed to find it full of gold. They decided to divide the gold equally among themselves. They were hungry and tired, so they sat under the tree and sent one of them to fetch food. In the absence, the other two decided to kill him and divide the gold themselves. The man who had gone to fetch food was very greedy. He thought, I will add some deadly poison in the food. He said to himself, I will, I will take the whole gold when they ate this poisoned meal. When he come to his competition, they killed him, but when they eat the poison meal, they too died. From this story we learn, what you sow is what you reap. The universe took after people who always focus on giving, not thinking about return. A few words of wisdom from Sri Bhagavad Gita, a karma yogi acts by body, mind, intact and sense without attachment only for self purification be a karma yogi from today today is the first day of your rest of life thank you wow that was a great story you are doing a great job dear keep it up